That's so where the hell did he just go? Uh, I wasn't watching. Where did he go? Is this? Nope, that's not it. Lahar, don't you get? I'm gonna get lost. I'm gonna get lost. <laughs> What's up guys, it's Riantium here, and today we are back in Skyrim, and oh snap, it's gonna be an awesome freaking day, but first, if you guys enjoy what you're about to see, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe for more daily videos, and if you haven't done already, follow me on Twitter, link is down there in the description. So guys, as the sun is rising over the Velothia Mountains, Clockwork City and the Clockwork Mansion is just chilling there, isn't it beautiful? Look at how amazing it looks. It looks so cool. I love it so much. So, let's go ahead and get started right where we left off last episode. So, last episode was just a tad bit terrifying, uh, and uh, hopefully today is uh, a little less terrifying. So, let's see. Looks like there's a guard at the gate. Hello there. Hi. Oh, God. Uh, hi. Oh God. Okay. What a warm welcome. Shadow under the mountain. I agree. It was. That's reassuring. This place is gorgeous looking. Look at that. Prime real estate, too. Looks really cool. Alright, Lahar. I'm gonna need you to go ahead and walk the... Walk a little bit faster, please. I love all the icicles hanging down. That looks really kind of nifty. So people are st or I shouldn't, I don't know if I can call these things people. They're like automatrons or something like that. It's kind of weird. Follow me. I'm following, I'm following. All right, good stuff. Where are you? I don't see you. Oh, he was behind me. <laughs> oh my goodness, it is quite dark in here. Let's go ahead and equip some torches just in case. Let's see, torch. Let's go and just do that and that. That's okay. Aha, uh -huh. that's why it's so dark. Look at these pictures and these portraits. That's kind of creepy, actually. Ugh, it's, they're all just staring at me. Alright. Look, those look like letters. M and B, it looks like. Okay. I'm digging all, like, the, the tapestries and stuff like that on the walls. They look really kind of nifty. And the wallpaper? Not much of a fan of the wallpaper. Looks, uh, too gaudy for me. But, uh, nevertheless, it looks pretty cool. Alright, cool. Nice little tour. Oh, look, there's little birds. Hi. Alright, still heading through. Clockwork Castle Grounds. Oh, snap, we're on top of the castle now. All right. Oh, hello. Is this the second person? It is. Lamashtu, okay. Okay, Lamashtu and Lahar. Oh, your hospitality is quite nice. Thank you. I feel so welcome here. Speak to Lamashtu, okay. I do. I feel so welcome here. I feel like a, a patron or visitor in a large large wealthy household. That's kind of nice. Hello there, Lamashtu. Who are you? And what are you doing here? I came through the mountain tunnels. And the tunnel collapsed. Yes, I heard it. No one has used those tunnels in well over a hundred years. Holy hell. There is only one other way out of the castle and this valley. Beneath the keep is the travel machine. It can transport you to the major settlements of Skyrim. That's kind of cool. She has a gramophone on her face. He will need to let you out on the other side. Can I ask you something? Ask him to let you out through the travel machine. 
Okay. Guess I can't. <laughs> Ask Lahar about the travel machine. Yeah, look, she's got a freaking gramophone. Like, uh, the, the bell that's on those, uh, on the gramophones. That looks kind of nifty. <clears throat> okay. So now we need to go back and find Lahar. What is this? Is this like an atrium? Glass garden. Oh, that's, there's probably some neat stuff inside of there. That's nifty. I love things that look like that. That's really cool. All right, cool. So, very cool. I'm getting kind of an, a steampunky vibe. Vibe, 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 if I can say the word vibe. I'm getting a steampunk vibe from this, and that's kind of nifty. But then again, the, the Dweamer, it kind of gives off that steampunk vibe. Because it's all, like, steam-powered and all that stuff, and it's it's all the, the brass and the copper, and it's all that crazy textures and stuff like that. Oh, it looks gorgeous in here now. Look at this. Look at that. Look at the chandeliers. The custom textures look amazing. They all just look so beautiful. Oh, god dang it. I will continue to ask to bedroom since you may be staying with us for some time. Oh my god, I do. I feel so welcome. Staying? Lamashtu said you'd show me to this travel that machine. Is strange. The travel machine is not functional at this time. In fact, very few machines here are working right now as the pressurized steam they rely on is not reaching the castle. Perhaps she forgot. Well, it's probably been a while. The travel machine is this way. Please, come this way. Cool. Follow Lahar. Yeah, I'm digging the decor. Like, it looks really cool. Definite- oh, whoa. Oh my- does that clock work? Oh, <laughs> I see what I did there. <laughs> clock work? It's the name of the damn mod, you moron. But does it? No way. That's B.A. If that thing works the way it's supposed to, then th <laughs> that's kind of nifty. Then that's kind of uh, revolutionary. That's kind of nifty. All right, let's, uh, let's keep following Lahar down into the depths of the dungeon. No, down into the depths of the castle. Is that an owl? Yeah, it is an owl. That's kind of nifty. I love all the little wall sconces. They're also custom. I'm digging every single thing. Everything is custom. Please, come this way. I'm coming, Lahar. Just keep walking. Walk. Okay, I'll go in first. Whoa. Whoa. Press button to set destination to Markarth Solitude. Uh, you are correct. No steam is reaching the machine. Enter the travel machine. Okay. Nothing's happening, Lahar. That's kind of interesting. That's cool, though. It's like a straight-up teleporter. Alright. Is there no other way out? Well, I could call my handy-dandy dragon. Hmm. After all, we are subject to the occasional tremor here from Red Mountain, I believe. Damn, they get tremors all right. the way from Morrowind? And such tremor is to blame for the lifeless machines around the castle. It was particularly violent and breached the main steam pipeline. I huh. attempted to repair the damage, but my brothers and sisters hampered my efforts and drove me out. Brothers and sisters? Yes. Tell me the earth you ran deep beneath the castle. They have grown wild, and we are no longer welcome there. I don't like the sound of that. Could I repair the damage? Good. Doing so would restore steam power to the castle, yes. The pipeline ferries steam from deep in earth you ran, but it is easy to find. It can be followed back from the castle. And it is spewing steam. From what I saw, at least ten sections of pipe have been breached. All must be replaced. Fortunately, plenty of scavenged replacement pipe 
ice alive without doubt that they were intended for eventual use in the castle. Alternatively, huh. if you know how to work through the metal, you may want to use one of the forges down there to cast your own. Aha! Uh -huh. Above all, however, be wary of my brothers and sisters, or they may attack you. Passage to Burnty Ground may be found through the mausoleum outside. Lamarche to has the key. You will need to obtain it from her. Which I assume will not be an easy task. Well, thank you, Lahar. I appreciate that. I will try to answer. If you wish for me to show you around some part of the keep, I can do that too. Sweet. So this guy can show us around. Get the mausoleum key from Lamash too. Okay. Uh, let's see. Which parts of the castle can you show me to? There's some work about the castle I'd like you to do. Wait, can I rest? Wait. Can I restore this? Very well. I shall clear them away. Oh, that's cool. Can you repair the peeling Certainly. wallpaper? That's cool. Of course. That's pretty nifty. Okay. Can I ask you something? I shall endeavor to answer. <laughs> what are you? <laughs> I am a caretaker. Thank you. I, I understand that. that You're a butler. No, I mean, are you the Dweamer? Uh, an animunculi? I, I am a caretaker. I also see to the needs of castle residents. Once the travel machine is again functional, I can use it to trade for necessities with merchants in Skyrim. Damn, okay. For you at that time. Interesting, okay. How do you go out into the public? Aren't you treated with suspicion? I wear robes. Huh. <laughs> you wear robes. Yes, and observers believe that beneath the robes, I am wearing a suit of Dwemer armor. Oh, look at you being all smart. Okay. Uh, tell me about the castle. The castle sits high in the velvety mountains that border Skyrim and Morrowind. Oh, that's why they feel it's tremors. It's well defended by virtue of its very remote and treacherous surrounds. It was built by the Podovec family in the closing years of the Third Era, some 200 years ago. Wow, it looks pretty good for being Podovec almost that old. The very successful traders, and the castle was intended to administer a new trading route between Skyrim and Morrowind. Through that tunnel? Good oh, lord, that's terrifying. So did anyone... Yeah, okay, I was gonna about to ask, so did anyone live here? <laughs> but yeah, they did, okay. This castle seems quite unusual. But I was told that this style of furnishing was popular in Hyrule some time ago. Hmm. Or perhaps you are referring to the machines. The first were built by Ludwig, though I believe not much to be helped. For the machines that were large in number, or in size, or in scope, though my brothers and sisters helped also. We all did. Huh. Who's Ludwig? Ludwig used to live here with us. It was he who first invited Lamarche to a night live in the castle. I have not seen Ludwig in a very long time. What happened? I don't know. I believe he kept a series of journals, however. Perhaps the answer can be found in their pages. I'll keep my eyes open. I've seen them scattered about the keep. You might try looking in the master bedroom, major study and travel room. Aha! A side quest. Okay, so let, wow, there are a ton more freaking dialogue options. All right, what do we got? Uh, let's see. What if I have to kill your brothers and sisters? They are like me. You cannot kill us. Oh God. They need to knock us down, but we shall rise again eventually. That's not terrifying not at all. Free. Okay. Uh, how did you light the lamp so quickly? I kind of worry. I kind of wondered that too. Lights, and are it only took a 
Good to know. Okay. Why do you, only you guys live here? It's not always like this. I've been used to live here too. So did his family and servants, but they all left long ago, shortly after the harsh tomb that I came here. Huh, okay. And let's see, are there any supplies available here? Feel free to make use of anything you may find lying about the castle. Very good to know. I am afraid though that until the travel machine is restored, further supplies, such as food, will not be available. Oh, don't worry about me, I'm a vampire. I don't need food. And then, last but not least, what is Nurndra? It's a freehold colony of the Dwemer, and my old home. Huh. Sadly, it is now a ruin, and we are no longer welcome there. Not much That's sad. I am fortunate to be able to now call Clockwork Castle our home. I would definitely say so. Awesome. Alright, good stuff. So we have officially exhausted all of his dialogue. <laughs> Oh wait, no, we have it. Crap. Which parts of the castle can you show me to? I kind of want to see the glass garden. Pneumatic? What the crap? Okay. Can you show me? Uh, I want you to show me the glass garden. Alright guys, I'll meet you in the glass garden. I really want to see what it looks like. Even though if there's not much to see in it, I just want to see what it looks like. Whoa, holy crap. Look at this place. Sort items from inventory to kitchen. Oh, no. Oh, oh snap. Are you serious? There's an auto sorting thing? Oh, so this is the mage's wing. That looks so freaking cool. Look at this, guys. So we got notes and letters. Look at that. Oh, guys, this is cool. It's alphabetized. <laughs> what? You got freaking alphabetized bookcases. Holy hell. What the? Corrosive, cor oh god, corrosive vapor warning. Okay, we'll come back in here, but I just happened to see the doorway, and uh, I just wanted to check it out, but damn, there's a complete sorting item. There's a complete sorting thing. That is nifty. Transfer items from receptacle to kitchen. So this is the pneumatic tube receptacle. So basically, there must be like a series of tubes that run throughout the entire castle that can sort things into certain containers. That's badass. Oh my god. It's just basically another castle shell blad, but it's so cool. Oh god, I love it. Okay. Okay, so it looks like we had to go through there. I just went in there before him and then it glitched out and all that good stuff. I assume we have to walk up that spiral staircase, but let's see what happens. Where's he at? All right, buddy, show me where it's at. This is a cool place, though. Like, look at this. That's so nifty. What's on top of it? Just some gears? That's so Where the hell did he just go? Uh. I wasn't watching. Where did he go? Is this... Nope, that's not it. Lahar! Don't you get... I'm gonna get lost. I'm gonna get lost. Okay, let's go up here and see if it's up here. Aha! Very good! Oh, dude, this is gonna be cool once it's filled. Are you kidding? Look at this. That's so cool. That's so nifty. Oh, this is pretty cool. I like this so cool. This is pretty neat. I definitely can dig this. Okay. You were, Lahar. I really appreciate you showing me around. Thank you so much. I'll go ahead and go talk to uh, the uh, the other person. I can't really remember her name. What is her name? Uh, Lamashtu. Okay, what is this? Activate valve. Oh, we'll get some water going. Look at that. Oh, that's so peaceful. Just some nice water. Why? Why? Why is that so peaceful? I don't. I don't get why that's so peaceful. I love that. That's nifty. I hope I can fill this full of like amazing looking plants. How cool would that be? Oh, I'm getting enthralled in this quest, guys. I am absolutely enthralled. I can dig this. Okay, let's go talk to Lamashtu. 
Alright, Lamashtu, I have a request. The steam pipeline is broken. I see. So the travel machine isn't working. Yes. Then you can stay. I appreciate the hospitality. Thank you. Stay here in the Please castle? Google. You are trapped here. Therefore you cannot leave here. Therefore you must live here. Okay. Lahar said to ask you for the key to the mausoleum. Yes, I had him give me the key. Lahar can be simple. If he had decided to go back down there and try to fix the pipeline again, he might not have returned. Could I have the key? Wish to try to fix the pipeline yourself. That was insanely easy. Very These well. people are very nice. Yeah. Wonderful. Perfect. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and talk to her next episode. But guys, I think I'm going to go and end off today's episode right here. Because what a freaking day. We have so much more to explore in the castle. And I cannot wait to see what is inside of this castle. Guys, can you imagine all the stuff that this castle has to offer? And what's hiding in the wings and all that stuff? It's just going to be so cool. So let's go ahead. Oh, Master Bedroom. MB. Duh. Let's end off inside of the Master Bedroom. Oh, guys, freaking Phoenix hasn't had a good night's sleep in so long, and look at this room. Oh, oh, guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode, and if you did, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe for more daily videos, and if you haven't done already, oh my god, look at that tub. Oh my god, I love it. Follow me on Twitter, guys. I'm now clean from bathing. And I will see you guys, oh I can't wait, in the next video.